When I was growing up, I was influenced by my mum and dad's record collection. My, my dad was into sort of folky stuff, and my mum was into um, Janis Joplin and Dr. Hook. <laughs> the Janis Joplin record was called Pearl, and then um, I used to get bullied at senior school quite badly, and I was ashamed to tell anyone. So there's a song called Cry Baby, and it's like really strong and powerful so I used to listen to that um, I just really admired her and, and I just really couldn't believe that there was someone around who was a woman that I felt I could relate to really I remember that I wanted to be accepted and I wanted to be a good artist but then the music thing wasn't something that I yearned for or like aspired to. It was just something that I did kind of secretly and naughtily on my own without anyone knowing about it. And I eventually started asking like one person or two people in and made them face the wall while I played them a song because I didn't know if they were good. I didn't know if I could sing. I was pretty rubbish on the guitar. And they liked it, and then one of those people got me a gig, and it was just like three songs on an acoustic night. And then I, I didn't ask for another gig, but people kept saying, oh, will you play here, will you play there? And before I knew it, I'd been like two years on the dole and doing gigs. And from there, I just sort of thought, oh, well, I'll make an album. And then I had this idea that I could send my record to a record company, and they would go, oh, yeah, we'll put it out, and da da da. And that didn't really happen the way I wanted it to so I just thought oh, well I'll put it out myself it's lost its charm change the scenery round take the colors of town where the noise is loud now where did my spirit go well it was strange because when I'd finished Dog Leap Stairs I really thought that I'd never be able to write another record and then Little Black Numbers just sort of happened and evolved and it just became as it was. And then it got nominated for the Mercury and then I signed a licensing deal with East West and, and then it became sort of the established album. But I felt the same with, with this album. When I finished Little Black Numbers I was thinking, well how can I write another album? And it just, Hair Too is my producer always says to me, um, an album makes itself, you just have to push it in the right direction. And uh, I like I like that idea. The titles of the albums are kind of pictorial, but without a sort of linear narrative. I've got this thing where it has to be three words in a title and it can't have and in the middle because that's rubbish. So there is Dog Leap Stairs, um, Little Black Numbers and then the new one is Old Low Light. And uh, I just like it. I like three words that fit together but not necessarily for a reason. And it just and, and it has to evoke the sort of feel of the album that, that is within those three words. So it's my little sort of superstition, like good day Mr Magpie or don't put new shoes on the table, all that sort of stuff that I got from my gran. <laughs> With a lot of the songs, I explain them after they've been written. But um, I think that's just, that's the way it is with most creative things. You don't explain them to yourself to create them. Otherwise, you get involved in why and how and what and everything like that. So I tend to create things and then realise what I've been on about afterwards. Because I think that there has to be some sort of immediacy there to have any sort of human emotion. So I really like the idea of things just developing in a studio and having a basic structure of the music and then things just happening over it which are really exciting. Some of them I, I feel like 
the words are much better than the music or, or I want people to listen to the words. But Devices is just sort of one of those daydreamy sort of songs that you listen to in the sun and, and it's nice and we wanted the we wanted a lot of the strings to not sound like an orchestra but to sound a bit like a messed up sort of quartet, maybe a bit sort of Eastern European and stuff. Thank you.